demo of the U1602B DSO. I'm using a rotor reflectometer which is used on generator rotor windings um, to send a signal down to see if there's any inter-turn faults. Okay, so there's the rotor reflectometer. That unit there is a little simulator that I'll use to create the signals. And then obviously the DSO is just there. Do you a turn on scopes now. So it's reasonably fast boot up. And we will turn on rotor reflectometer now. So there's the initial signal. Let's go around there. So I'll do a test with it as it sees now, because as you see, it's not the best of screens from different angles. I'll try and stick you underneath there. What do you look like then? Oh, I can see a bit better then, can I? Okay, so what I'll do to demo the signal, you need to shorten wire. And it has to go in two pins, so when I put it into the first one, there should be no change in the waveform. In one. And you should see me plug it into, it said it does react fairly quickly. Signal hopefully. Zoom into the display. Let's see if that, uh, so I'll put the signal on now. And you can see it changes. Off, on, off, on, off. A little demo of the scope on the output of the DMM Check Plus. And that, that's the AC output on this unit. Here we go. Off again, on again, off again, on again. So you see a reaction time is quite good. I've never had any issues with this. Uh, reaction wise um, we'll just do so the other aspect you've got with this um, taken over here uh, we can go to DMM mode uh, which is meter and then voltmeter F1 for auto plug him in down So you see this response is a little bit slower on meter mode, but it's not too bad. Uh, I'll take him back to DC on the DMM. He's a little bit slow uh, DMM wise. Seems a bit more accurate on AC than it does on DC. Okay, so the other one. Oh, I haven't let the DMM check plus warm up, mind you. And the other one, if I go back to meter, I'll take it to an ohm meter. Should be 100 ohms. There you go. Move it around to 1k. Move it again to 10k. And finally on the 100k. Okay, so that's DMM operation. Okay, buzzer continuity test, because I know you look like that. It's not particularly a buzzer, but quite responsive. 